How you going guys? This is Kit beside me. How old are you Kit? I'm 14. Well, you're a big boy for 14. Yeah, I know, yeah. Kit's uh, coming for a rabbit hunt with me today. He follows the channel and uh, Murray, my neighbour you guys know, uh, is he your is he your uncle, is he? No, friends, yeah. Oh, yeah. just friends, are yeah. you? So Murray said, hey, would you take young Kit out? And I said, yeah, well, we'll do something. Can't do much right now, so we'll go and try and snot a rabbit with the old Chinese cheap 22. You've done a bit of hunting though, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I put this, this, this high vis on because I wanted to give the rabbits a chance because he's apparently a pretty good hunter. So no. I'll show up. <laughs> oh, we'll see how you get on with the 22. I'm just going to finish my cup of tea. I just made a ball the billy and I was waiting here for Kit to turn up. He's been telling me about um, doing correspondence lessons. I used to do correspondence lessons. Does your mum teach you? No, I get it online. Online, yeah. yeah, yeah. See, when I was a kid in the Abel Tasman National Park, yeah. Uh, 50 years ago, over 50 years ago, 53 years ago, there was no online, it was the no. telephone and yeah. Wellington would send a whole lot of stuff and my mum would sit there and I'd be looking at all the dolphins out the window and driving her nuts because yeah. I hated it. And, <laughs> yeah, so you just yeah. did online yourself. Yep. Mm. Yep. I have um online shooter. Right. It's cool. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. How's that working out for you? Yeah, it's good. I'm living on a farm, I like to get out and do stuff, so it's a bit... Yeah. Oh, better do it though, so... Right. Yeah. Kit suffers from a condition called colitis, which is really horrible. My mum had the same thing, and she, mum was really sick. Do you get vomiting with that at all or not? I did when I was real sick, but um, mm. pretty good now. So. Yeah, because I remember my mum throwing up all the time. She came right. A really good doctor in the North Island is Dr. Glenn Davies, mm. and he belongs to, you can hunt him down, he belongs to uh, a company called NZ Reversal, New Zealand Reversal. So basically they reverse things like diabetes type 2, Things that, that can be fixed with lifestyle, yep. and a good a good doctor is really important when you've got a battle like that, because really for colitis there's two main sort of things that general medicine does, either surgery or steroids, and they're not always either, oft, often have side effects. So it's yep. an autoimmune disorder, isn't it? Yep. Yeah, yeah, it is, yeah. So what are these symptoms that you struggle with with that? Um, oh okay. yeah cramps in my gut, and yeah. diarrhea, and yeah. And vomiting too? Yeah. You look healthy, man. You look like you bloody yeah. carry a pig out of the bush. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> One of the big things would be, uh, f for a young man like you, uh, I guess this is really difficult, is doing stuff with your mates when they're all going out yeah. and doing stuff and, yeah. and you're left behind. Yeah. Struggle that I'd struggle with that. Uh, when you're younger, that's the thing is your mates are so important, eh? And if you can't play rugby or you can't go on a hunt or you can't do stuff, a lot of that's quite hard, yeah. so yeah, I empathise with you, it'd be, yeah. be hard going. Yeah, being home a lot of the time, definitely get a bit lonely. Yeah. But oh, sure, yeah. yeah, yeah. Hey, we'll go and see if we can get a rabbit before it gets dark. Yeah, right. And uh, yeah, thanks for sharing your story. Nah, it's fine, Bloody yeah. Bloody good. Yeah. Just over this brow here, there's normally a rabbit. We're actually heading into Murray's property. I'll let you get along this bush line here, Bud, so you're in front of me. So you can see first, just keep your head slightly up. Couple of the quail in the driveway, Californian quail. You could probably head shoot one of those, couldn't you, bud? <laughs> not, not that we'd do that, of course, because it's no. completely illegal, eh? <laughs> we wouldn't do that. No. <laughs> you ever eaten quail? Um, yeah, we've got a few wild quail on our place. Have you so eaten yeah. them? No, I haven't eaten one, but no. Nah. Oh, bloody good, they're sweet. Yeah. Oh, we'll just go down here a bit more and see what we can see. Might be something around this corner here. We're losing the light now, but I can't focus. Well, it looks like four quail on the driveway down there. Yeah. Mm. The old paradise duck giving us away there. See, Murray and Mary have got some nice chrysalises going on these swine plants. There was a few there. Bloody wasps are eating all mine. Yeah, I actually turned around. 
Well, that might be better, but you want to get a decent. Wait till he just shifts a bit. There you go. He's back down again. Oh, beauty! You beauty! You beauty! You snotted it, mate! Oh, hey, put it there, brother! That was a cracker shot, mate! A bloody long shot, too! I heard it collect. Well done, fella! You smashed it! Well, that's a dynamite shot. You told me before you only do headshots. Yeah. Didn't sound like a headshot, uh, did it? it sound like no, a, a like a, yeah, yeah, sound like a lung shot. Oh, good luck not getting chased by the ball in there. He's over there. Yeah. There's the next paddle. I'm just, just pulling the leg. Yeah. <laughs> I actually uh, dropped one of these cows last week for Murray. Did he tell you that? No. Yeah, no, I shot one. Sick or something. Yeah, had a bit of cancer on it. Yeah. Look, there's another rabbit running away. Look, there's a few. I just take one at a time as I need him for Tucker. Yeah. Love rabbit. Cool. See if you can find it. Yeah. It's got some tumour on its head. It's got a tumour on its head, has it? Yeah. Oh, you might have done it a favour. Oh, we're not eating its head. He might have that virus going around too, but his dog tucker. Yeah, no, you did him a favour. Oh, that's a shame, isn't it? What's going on here? I think he's got some virus, but the virus is going around right now. Oh, yeah, he's dog tucker. Mm. I won't be chewing on that one, I'll tell you. No. Yeah, it's a bit sick. It's actually not in bad condition other than that, though, is it? Oh, I don't know. It's a male, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's an old jack. He's not in good nick at all. Yeah, no, that's... He's got that he's got that growing on his head like a tumour over his eye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah they're not having that head. That's, uh, yeah, that's it's a bit, pretty manky, yeah. isn't it? So knock the front off and the back off. Yep. Just right through there, through the engine room. Good smack. That's the one. Cool. Nice. Sweet as. Oh, Pace is going 100 mile out. Look, there's got to be a, what do you reckon, a rat? Where's the rat, Pace? Where's the rat? Here's a little rat. Actually, out of all the dogs, it's Poe that'll catch it every time. She's really good. He's a digging a good old hole, isn't he? The tail going 100 mile out. Where's the rat, Pace? Where's it going, Pace? Hey, where's the rat? You pose the one that catches them, though. She's really good at it. Yeah. Where's it going, Pace? Where's the rat, eh? Where's it going? Hey, where's it going, eh? It's probably digging a hole faster than you could dig on with a spade there, yeah. Kit. She's at China soon. <laughs> well, I hope not. <laughs> well, Poe's digging over here in the dark. Her tail's good. What's that, Poe? Where's the rat, Poe? Where's it going, Poe, eh? Hey? Gee, these phones are brilliant. It makes everything bright. Look how bright that is on the phone compared to how it is when you look at her. Oh, yeah, yeah. Amazing difference, isn't it? Yeah, it is, yeah. Well, you've dug a good old hole here, Pace, but I don't think you're going to find it, mate. I think it's gone, long gone. Right, uh, that's your dinner, mate. Two back legs. Eat up, Bigsy. Eat up. Don't take the hand, take the rabbit. <laughs> All the place you could grab. What's that, Pace, eh? Hey, eh? ooh. Into his cave. Yep, straight in there. Eat up, Poe. There you go. If that's my dog Bruno, he just eat that one big bite that and you crunch it up. Eggshells from duck eggs was munching up, which is actually really good for him. It's for calcium. Rabbit needs having that. Is that good boy, eh? It's good because actually that's how it gets calcium. I give my dogs uh, eggshells. Bigger young pup growing bone. It's actually good for him. Oh, bud, it was a bit of fun anyway. Yep, yeah, hey, it's good to meet you, you too. Yeah. You put it there. Yep. And uh, if you're around till Wednesday, if we go out for a hunt, we'll let you know. You we probably, right. probably won't know where this is going, but we'll yep. see how it goes. Yep. You're going to leave on Wednesday, are you? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we'll see how we get on. Might be Tuesday, actually. I'm not too sure. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll find out for you. I'll just give Murray a ring. All right, yep. And uh, good luck with your uh, challenge with having colitis and how you work through that. Yep. Yeah, there's a lot of good doctors, a lot of good stuff online. Hey guys, thank you for watching this video. There's not much you can see because it's dark now. Hope you enjoyed it and we'll catch you the next one. And meanwhile, uh, try and be good out there. And if you can't be good, be careful. Get back in your box, Pace. Back in your box. He wants to come out and see what Bigsy's eating. Yeah. Go on, get in your box, Pace. There's your box. Good boy, he's back in there. Look at him. Oh, Bigsy's still chomping on it.